I don't understand what's going on, but I know there's something wrong with me. You start losing contact with your brain. All that ammonia and toxicity in my brain felt like, like almost like it was on fire. I'm blank. I go blank. It's like, the, like a sphere sometimes in my brain. I feel like the sphere, you know, touch it, you go, whoa, whoa. And that's how my thinking is. It's like, I know there's pressure here. Living on high alert is, uh, it's become a way of life. Is today the day? Is this it? It's awful living like that. If I lost Deborah, I mean, I'd be lost. To try to manage a uh, 11 year old little girl whose mom's real sick, you know, whose dad's heart's broken. I don't like waking up to someone laying on the floor or laying in the bathroom in a coma. You don't know, Sandy. I know. Your son most definitely doesn't want to sit here and watch you die. Don't take care of me no more. You then. can't take care of yourself. We saved her body, but now mentally, she's not there anymore. Uh, I thought I'd never talk to mom again. Me too. I don't know. I can't think about the future right now. I just have to take it a day at a time. It's like something else is taking over my sister. That's not my sister. How long do we have to see you deteriorate with HG before something else is done for you? The monster is the root of HE. I want to get rid of it. Why, why? I've already went down and wrestled those roots a number of times. So you think to yourself, this weed should still, 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 this, still, still, this weed still, still this.